Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. The Sims actually has some sort of event going on right now called the Day of the Dead. What is this? The Day of the Dead Challenge ends in 26 days and 20 hours. This household has collected zero out of nine sugar skulls. To participate in the challenge, use your Sims cell phone, select the social tab, and then call Jasmine Holiday. When Jasmine arrives, speak with her to learn about the Day of the Dead. I think we should do it because it sounds really interesting. So let's ring. Is it this? Oh, it's here. Call Jasmine Holiday. I really want to know what this is. It sounds very interesting and we can do it alongside having babies. So all is good. I just really want to see what it is. Okay, we should go out and harvest this garden. This is looking good. Harvest all of these plantionis. You know what? I'm very happy with this household. I really love this place. Oh, oh, is this? I thought that was going to be Jasmine Holiday, but it's actually Nina Caliente, and she is a Day of the Dead celebrator. So I am loving this costume girl. I'm going to guess Day of the Dead is the Mexican, like, festivity? I'm not really sure. I'm not very good at my Mexican history, but I'm pretty sure that's where it comes from. I'm going to get Christina to repair this because we ain't got time to do that. You broke it, you fix it, basically. Oh yeah, she's on the phone to her. Quite excited to see what's happening. Is she pregnant? Yes, she is. Second trimester. So basically today's episode is just going to be like a boring waiting around episode until she gives birth, basically. Jasmine Holiday should be here. Oh, level 10 in gardening? Boy, you gone good. Hey, what's this? Who's this? Oh, honestly, loving these costumes everyone's wearing. Leonardo DiCaprio. Look at that diamond encrusted shirt though. Rocking it. Sims is looking amazing. Who is this? Oh, girl. I don't know how to say your name. You're looking good too. Why are we not dressed up? I feel like we're missing out. Also, Jasmine Holiday never came over. She lied to us. I'm sad about it, but we need to find sugar skulls and I'm not sure where we find them. So that's why I needed Jasmine to come over, but she lying to me. Oh my gosh, Sims plays around the world have collected over a million sugar skulls. That's amazing. Where's ours? We don't know. What if we try get Christina to call? No, she won't. She's gone. She's too tired for this. We'll have to do it in the morning and then maybe she'll actually turn up because she's probably asleep right now. We need to make sure everybody's done their homework. So that's something I'm gonna do now. Do homework. I don't care if y'all feel uncomfortable, if y'all tired, I'm gonna do it. Because I don't care. The only person who's actually done it is Victoria. Good girl, Victoria. Everybody else is just time wasting. We actually have some grade A students. I didn't realize we're gonna have some birthdays after everybody gets back from school tomorrow. We're also gonna check that everyone's got their skills up. Yep, yep, yep. Wait, you've not even done your homework, Christina. What are you playing at? Do the last percentage of your homework. There we go. She's done it. Now you can sleep. I don't see why that was such a hard thing to do. You literally just had to do the tiniest percentage of homework. Why couldn't you have done that originally? I don't know. I'm just selling all of the plants to see how much money we have because I feel like we have a lot of money actually. I want to save up so that we can all move into one of the huge mansions because that would be so cool because we started out in this kind of small basic house, a new build house that's really cute actually. It reminds me of my own house. It's kind of just basic, has what you need in it, a couple of bedrooms. And then we're gonna move into a luxury mansion with loads of bedrooms and loads of things to do. Kind of like when we lived at Jack and Elsa's house. That was so cool when we lived there. But obviously it wasn't our place to live, so we had to move. But I'm wanting to move our family back into somewhere like that because I feel like the Simmer family deserve a break and deserve luxury. I wonder if it'll even be Amy's family by the time that we move there or if Amy will be dead because I said they age to normal compared to extreme or epic whatever it is because I just want to progress more with this. It's kind of fun playing with different sims so it'll definitely be a lot harder with money as well. Let's have a look at how old everyone is. Oh wow she is actually she's actually turning into an elder. After we've given birth we're pretty much an elder already so it's actually Kinda soon, like, she's aged up real fast. I wasn't expecting her to turn old so quick. Kinda shocked. You know, I think I might actually try and buy a potion and use that so she can, you know, 
have some more kids because she hasn't really had that many kids. Like I wanted her to have more. If we have a look, she's only had seven kids. So I feel like she needs to have more because look at her mom. Her mom had so many kids. My gosh, look at those. Yeah, I have sister Ashley. Honestly, can't even remember Ashley. Sorry about it. And it seems... Our other brothers and sisters, like Mistletoe is real old now. We have Willow, we have Trevor Simmer, and also Luna who is married to Leonardo DiCaprio. And they've got kids together. <gasps> A little alien baby called Braylon. How adorable. Oh, this is very interesting, but yeah, I want Amy to stick around a bit longer. If we could do that, that'd be good. How much is a potion? A potion of youth. Where is it? Potion of youth. 1,500. You know what? We have enough for that. So we're gonna drink it because I don't want to be old yet. Drink, drink, drink away. There we go. Ooh, magical. I think after, you know, she's had this baby and a couple more, then she'll be ready to move on. But we've literally only just really started with her. So it'd be a shame to just move on without Amy. Yeah, that'd be kind of quick. So... Maybe I should just keep it on normal lifespan, but use a potion of youth just before they turn old. Just one. Depending on how many episodes we get out of them, I guess. Let's start the gathering to get this gardening done. Travis is an old man now. Look at that. He's old. What happened? I also have no idea who we've had babies with or not. I've just forgotten it all. I've forgotten every single thing. Because we don't seem to have relationships with anyone anymore. What happened here? I don't think we have with Sergio, so maybe he could be one of the next. And we count with Rex because he's a family member and that's weird. Let's look at her age now. She should be back down to an adult. Yeah, cool. I can't even remember Amy turning into an adult. It feels like she's always been an adult. I remember when she was a little kid though. Crazy how time passes in this game. Also, she should not be gardening because she is a mama. Ooh, kids are cooking food. I like how they only cook one portion. They don't cook for anyone else but themselves. Hey kids, your mom are hungry too. To be honest, that looks disgusting. It's poor quality. I don't even want to eat that. Looks like trash. You know what? I'm going to steal it. If you're just going to stand there looking at it, I'm going to take it. Bye. Why do Sims make food and just not pick it up? It doesn't make any sense at all. Stupid Sims. Oh, and he just nicked her food. Well, it's a circle of life, ain't it? Oh, Jenna. You're gonna need to get one skill to level two. And the easiest one to do for that is talking. So when she gets back from school, we're just gonna talk a bunch. Look at Victoria just wasting food there. Why would you do that? Just wasted that. What a waste. I'm actually so curious to see how much one of those mansions are to buy. Also, why are the kids not at school? Go to school, lazy pants. So I'm gonna check that out, actually. If we can end the gathering here. End the gathering, everybody. We can maybe go in the housing market and have a check to see how much everything is. Move household, let's have a look. Where would we wanna live, though? That's the question. -y. <gasps> that one, is that one? We live there right now. We could. We could actually move there. But I wish you could see information about it. But I think that why is that 127,000? And that one is 51. Why? It doesn't make sense. Why is that so much more expensive than that? What? Unless that's bigger. I just don't know. That one looks cooler though. We want to live there. 51,000. So that is what I'm aiming for. Oh, uh, boy, you looking good today, Alessandro Marino. <laughs> right, 51,000, not bad, because we get some money for selling the house, I think. So let's pay our bills and all that good stuff, and we're just gonna make loads of money. So I really wanna do that. I couldn't reach our mailbox, but I managed to throw the mail in there. Good luck getting it back out. What? Let's say hello to him, because he could be a potential suitor. Hey, mailman. Flirty introduction, yes. Let's embrace him. See what he says. Just met you, but let's embrace. Oh, yeah. He likes that. Hugging strangers is my hobby. Now feel my baby. This is this is actually very creepy. What is going on? Just met the mailman. We're hugging him and getting him to feel our stomach. This is strange. This is so strange. <laughs> Did you hear him? He was like, whoa, dude. There's a baby in there. <laughs> what? Yeah, I really want to move house. I know we just moved in here, but I want to move again. I want to get a mansion. And from there, we're just going to move into bigger mansions. 
Oh my gosh, Dimitri literally just aged up. I didn't even know. Like I was fast forwarding so he could repair the shower and he just aged up, like repairing the shower. Seniority, <laughs> I can't even say that word. How do I say it? Seniority, seniority, seniority. I cannot say that word from the life of me. What is going on? Wrinkled bellies, frosty locks, and the interminable naps away. See, I cannot speak today. I apologize. Party like the Grim Reapers, not right around the corner. Dimitri, I know it's your birthday and all, but no one cares, unfortunately. Why is Lucifer not at school? What? Just rocking up at like, 12 p.m. What are you doing with your life? Test day. Christina has two different tests today and one of them is going to be tough. There's a little time to study beforehand. Should she spend all of her time studying for the hardest test or use the time to study for both? Let's study the hard test. Oh, we lost performance. It seems every time I do this one, I always get it wrong. See, Victoria's got it. Should we do study both? What did she get for that? Performance gain, okay. I know the secret of it now. All of these, like, I've done a million times. They should honestly add more in because I've read them all a thousand times. A million times. A gazillion times. I'm just so sick of them. Also, I still want to do this Day of the Dead thing. We need to get that done today. Why is Lucifer not going to school? Why won't he listen to me? Go to school. He is so rebellious, he won't even listen to me, the controller of all sims. I am God to him and he still won't listen. Dimitri, don't cry about your birthday. Let's call Jasmine Holiday. Said she'll be over, but I feel like she's lying again. Why does no one want to come to our house? Is there something wrong with us? Is it glitched? Does nobody want to come to our house? Who even is Jasmine Holiday? And why won't she come to do this challenge, this test with us? Being lied to. You know what we need to do? We need to get some birthday cakes on the go right now. Let's clean out the spoiled food and let's make some birthday cake. <laughs> some birthday cake, just one cake will do. We'll just reuse the candles because we're cheap. If Dimitri would have just waited a little while, we could have celebrated his birthday with everyone else's. Here we go, birthday cake. Let's add the candles and let's see who needs to age up. Don't you dare. Oh my gosh, I'm just done. I'm just done with my life. Absolutely stealing the cake. Thought anyone can even put candles on it. So done, now you're gonna have to make a cake. How do you feel about it? Okay, we got that in the end. Let's add the birthday candles quick before anyone can steal them. Let's go do our homework because she's in a good mood so she may as well do it now while everybody else is aging up. Right. We have Lucifer, who actually can age up right now. Even though his performance is going into orange because he keeps missing school. So better hurry up before he goes down a grade. Yay, Lucifer. He's actually gonna make such a handsome adult. I think he's very cute, I like him. So what can we have that goes along with being evil? Kleptomaniac's cool, cause he's just gonna steal everything. I like that, let's do it. And then let's add birthday candles. And then we can age up our next sim, which is Titus. Let's blow out the candles. Come on, Titus. I know you're feeling sad, but it's time to age up. Here we go. Titus is becoming a young adult. Nice. Good job. So he's a very good and brainy sim. He's also going to be ambitious. He wants to get far in his life. I can't blame him. There we go. We've got two adult sims now. I think we should move them out. I'm not quite sure where though. Okay, Titus. We're gonna move into a new household with Lucifer. And then we're gonna move these two in. Someone else who is living alone right now. Let's move them in here. In the cookout lookout. Sounds cool. Here they are with their new house. That's kind of just like, <gasps> what even is this? This is so small. Let's get designing it for them. Also, it is very backwards. <laughs> the house is uh, a year backwards. Okay, I sorted out the house so it's not backwards anymore. Still kind of looks backwards, but it's okay. I added this nice little patio here. Same as the back, but I made it just so it wasn't looking like it was totally back to front and I added a path. All good now, all good. Okay, now let's get working on the bedrooms. So this can be a bedroom and this can be a bedroom, although it's kind of unfair. You know what, this can be a bedroom here. So here we have it guys, this is the house. Isn't it cute? It's very small, but it's got everything in here that they need. And I tried to make it look a bit lived in by adding stuff around such as, you know, the items which have to shave, books and stuff. And in here we have just like random books and some photos. 
This room also wasn't big enough to put in a double bed, but I know people like to have their double beds even if it means pushing it up against the wall, so it's not too unrealistic to expect that. Then we also have a pile of screwed up clothes that they've just like thrown into the corner there. Typical boys, just joking. We also have some lovely ornaments here. Amazing, really loving this gnome. Wonder if he's gonna make his way around the house. Tiny kind of little living room area, which I was gonna put the kitchen here, but I decided against it because there would have been no room to have a living room here. I did try, but with this door being here, it's kind of like inconvenient. So yeah, this is a tiny kitchen, but very, very practical for boys because there's not really much to do. There's just two of them living here and they'll probably just live on takeaway anyway. So I guess we can get them jobs somehow. You really need to find a job. And then they can get on with living their lives. Find a job. Dimitri should be a thief. Criminal. Yes. Perfect. And then Titus. Find a job too. You should be an astronaut because why not? You want to go far. So there we have it guys. I'm going to leave the boys here. Hopefully they have good lives. And I'll eventually off camera get them both girlfriends or boyfriends. And move them out of this place. So they can start their own family. So there we have it guys. We're back with our family. I think this is where I'm going to leave today's episode guys. Hope you did enjoy it. If you did, do make sure to leave a like. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.